Seeking to quench a political firestorm, President Obama is moving to help the millions who've lost their health coverage by letting insurance companies continue selling plans for another year, even if they fail the new law's coverage rules. Now, this fix won't solve every problem for every person, but it's going to help a lot of people. He says he knows people are angry after hearing him promise those who like their plan can keep it. To those Americans, I hear you loud and clear. And he acknowledges his vow proved to be inaccurate. That's on me, and that's why I'm trying to fix it. However, Obama is not forcing insurance companies to rescind the cancellations, and it's unclear how many will do that. Some companies say it's simply too late since rates for next year are already set. And Republicans say Obama can try all he wants, but his plan's beyond repair. Uh, a, this government-run health care plan called Obamacare. This is going to destroy the best health care delivery system in the world. House Republicans plan to vote on a fix that goes well beyond Obama's. Between the cancellations and the botched rollout of healthcare.gov, Obama told reporters he knows his team fumbled his plan's rollout and made life tough for fellow Democrats. And I think it's legitimate for them to expect me to have to win back uh, some credibility on this health care law in particular and uh, on a whole range of these issues in general. But he vowed the website flaws will be repaired and other wrinkles smoothed out. And ultimately, his signature domestic initiative will get it right. Mark Smith, The Associated Press, The White House.